You moved here. I did. Yeah. You I moved like here it. since we last talked to you. Yeah. You made a big move. So like, um, cause you moved from New York. Yeah. Wow. And was there part of you that was kind of scared? Was there like, what were you thinking? Cause I mean, I've thought about it, you yeah. know, and, and a lot of people have done it, you yeah. know? No, I'd come down here a lot cause you know, do Rogan's podcast, do podcasts down here, do comedy. So yeah. I've been down here enough. So I wasn't worried about like living here. I was worried about, uh, comics being like a oh, pussy. He left New York. He's trying oh, to fucking really? suck Rogan's dick. That that was like I was like that's gonna happen. I know that. Mm-hmm. Uh, no, I was excited. Matt was excited about it, so I knew I had Matt coming down with me. And then we brought our other friends, and it's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I uh... and ta- taxes are. Oh yeah, butt fuck New York, dude. Yeah, it's yeah. crazy. It's great. Yeah, and uh, oh, what's that in your daughter's bedroom? What's that in the pillowcase? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's extra taxes. That's, that's taxes, what taxes, dude. Yeah, that's, that's, Eric that's taxes in a couple of somas, bro. <laughs> like, damn, right. A lot of taxes up there. Oh, it's crazy. It's an extra, yeah. I think, 14%. What's the state tax rate in New York City right there, Zachary? I think it's uh, 10 point. Oh, he's nine. guessing. What is it? No, I'm not yeah. guessing. I got it right here. <laughs> Four percent to ten point nine percent. You see here. Wow, because Los Angeles is thirteen, I think. Percent. Yeah, I was hovering around that four percent range for a while <laughs> when I lived in New York. And then you probably moved up into at least that six point eight five percent. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, dude. So that's kind of crazy. So you moved. Yeah, like yeah, I think some people say that they're like, "Oh, do you want to move there? Because Rogan's there. Because Dylan's there. It seems like the new thing." And I think yeah, I kind of maybe I don't know if I had some fear. I I, I don't know. I, I don't know if I had fear of that. You definitely think, oh, people think you're just, yeah, you're just riding that guy's yeah. wiener, you know? Yeah. Somebody, fine. Had, yeah. I mean, um, but also he's like, I would say it if I was still in New York. Yeah. <laughs> somebody else moved here. I'd be like, fucking <laughs> pussy couldn't take it. <laughs> I'd do the same thing. So, yeah, come back and pay these high yeah, taxes. Pay these queer. fucking taxes. Live in a <laughs> shithole in New York. Yeah. Um, but no, I just wanted to move to a place where you could do stand up during the week. And yeah. forever, it was just New York and L.A. That's now, true. You, now you can do it in Nashville and Austin. Does it feel... Well, Nashville, you cannot. Oh, really? Yeah, you cannot. It's not the same. I will... I'll say that 100%. It is not the same as what the, it feels like here. Yeah. Like, even just going over to um, the mothership, it's like you can do three sets in a night, probably. Yeah, yeah you, can do, you can do four every single time. There's wow. usually two shows in the small room, two in the wow. main room. I mean, that's so You crazy. do four sets a night, yeah. Four sets a night in the same building that you can go do. I mean, that's uh, that's unprecedented. Yeah, it's you know? changing. What's nice is watching like like McCusker, because he was in Philly where you can't do that, Mm-mm. and now he's been living here just a few months, and he's he's got he's gotten so good. Really, just from doing yeah, he can do yeah. it every night. Yeah, I met him yeah. last night, or I met him uh, at your yeah, I met him at your podcast. I met his wife too. Yeah, Brittany is her name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she got he got a beautiful little wife. Yeah, and, she's great. Um. Yeah, dude, I think having that much ability to get up is, it starts to change you. You're like, oh, I just practiced it. It didn't go in there. Let me let me yeah. try it. You're like right there. <laughs> you get the bomb four yeah. times. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Take it on the road and be like, I'm not going to change anything. <laughs> Fuck, it's still not working. <laughs> what has been like, uh, did you find a house immediately? How did you find a house down here? Uh, I just had a lady, a real estate lady. I was like, I just need a house that's furnished because I don't have anything. Yeah. So she first house she picked out, I was like, that's it. Oh, yeah. And I didn't see it until I moved in. No. It was nice. Yeah, I moved in. I was like, it's fucking nice. Oh, it's like that yeah. show where you meet your wife the first time. <laughs> yeah. That's brave. I was bro. The thing I was most worried about was the television. Because mm-hmm. I thought it was like, they. I thought they were going to hit me with like the Airbnb pictures. Oh, like you yeah. get there and you're like, oh, fuck, this house sucks. TV's big. Right. So I'm good. Oh, that's good. We're huh? set. Thank God it's furnished or I would have never, I'd never furnish it. Really? Yeah, I'd have one folding chair in front of the TV. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, my house was furnished when I got my house, thank God. And uh and then who told me? Oh, Tom Segur told me in this room he said, "Hey man, you got to start getting some art for yourself. You have to get something you like because it really does start to change the way that you think about your own Tom's, home." Tom's becoming like the Jay-Z of stand up. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's like you got to invest in art. You got to. <laughs> yeah, he's got art, he's got sneakers. Yeah. He's got uh Yamaha uh what the car is called, the fastest one? McLaren? McLaren, is that it? Yeah. That's wild to me. I think I would be scared to be, like, real rich. I wouldn't know how to do it. I bet you're all right. 
Oh, I think I, I'm, <laughs> yeah. a, I'm okay having more money for sure. But I think if I tried to be real rich, I just don't know how I would, I don't know what I would spend money on, you know? Like, would you get a super fast car? Um, no, I don't. I'm afraid to drive fast. Yeah, yeah, I think, yeah. yeah. I just don't know what I would get. Probably guns, probably. A couple. You got to get guns. Yeah. A couple for your neighbors, a couple for you. Yeah, give them out. Yeah, you don't want to shoot at your neighbors. Hide and them, they in, don't your have anything hide to them shoot. in your kids' room. <laughs> <laughs> your neighbors' kids' room. Start fucking planting guns. How's it? Have you felt good about moving here? Now, once you moved here, was it kind of like different or was it different than you thought? Like, what are some things that were kind of cool about it? I don't know. It's, I, you know, you know, when you move, I was sad for like a week. Oh, really? Yeah, I was by myself. It was scary. I was used to having fucking, I was used to living in apartments. I lived in Philly and New York the last decade. So yeah. I was like, there's usually somebody around. Now I was out there by myself. I got scared for a while. I was scared. Really? I get scared at night. Noises. Yeah. Yeah. You think it's a noise and it's just you farted. <laughs> just waking myself up yeah. with farts. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck was that? <laughs> Uh yeah, I mean I was scared for a while. Yeah, I would I was emotional. I'd cry during movies when I was at at night by myself. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, so that's what you have to look forward to. <laughs> it's scary and you cry. <laughs> that's it. Oh, that's just I think that's just part of the American condition <laughs> these days. Then oh you're fine then. Yeah, that was all. Um, yeah, because I think I thought I, I don't know if I thought Nashville would be a busier comedy scene. I I, I didn't think that. Um. Because they just have one club. It's like a functioning club yeah. there, right? Yeah, it's like yeah, they yeah. have a, a headliner weekend. flies in every weekend. So they, they help you as much as they can, but they just yeah. don't have as much space, you know? Um, and then there's not a lot as many other rooms around the area. But here it's like, yeah, it feels like you could go. Like we met a guy last night. He'd done like five spots, you know? Yeah, you can do that here. It's like, wow. Yeah. I mean, that's crazy to think you could do that in a city. I mean, there was never maybe Chicago you could do that in? Maybe. I don't know. New York, obviously you can. Yeah. L.A. L.A., definitely. Those are the two. Yeah. But that was, uh, yeah, I don't know. Do you think about moving back from here? you think you're settled in? You're good? Be, I don't know. I don't think I'll live here forever. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. I like it here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What? That's just a big... I don't... I, yeah. I'll, I'll, I don't know. I'll probably move home to, like, outside of Philly. Wow. Yeah. Eventually. Yeah. Yeah, I like it up there. I don't know. Sometimes I think about maybe moving or getting a li also living somewhere else. I, I think it's fun to spend time down here. Austin is Austin's cool. Fun. You can do stand up. It's a beautiful city. Yeah, it's, it's just a nice like city. It's a fun city. Yeah, there's a lot it's of cool. neat stuff. Yeah, there's a lot of neat stuff. I think so. That's been pretty cool. <laughs> just thinking about it, you know, even yeah. just coming and seeing like your house. It's like, oh, okay, this is what it would be like to live yeah. here. This seems like I could do this, you know.